In this video, we will learn how to navigate the InDesign workspace. We'll be examining three main workspace areas, the menus, the application bar, the toolbar, and the panels. In our menu, many of these are familiar with Word programs, or they're very intuitive, so if you want to work with objects, you're in the object menu. We're going to look at something called workspaces. So if you go to Window and Workspace, you can see we have a series of workspaces that are available to us. These workspaces make tools and panels available for specific jobs, such as digital publishing or interactive design. The default workspace is the Essentials workspace. If you need to reset this workspace because panels or tools were moved, simply go down to Reset Essentials. You can also personalize and save a workspace you like. We'll look at some of the other menu items in later chapters. Let's take a look at our application bar. First thing we have is an icon that allows us to jump over to Adobe Bridge, which allows you to preview and look at your images. Next, you can change your view options, such as view percentage, rulers, guides, and how to view different open documents. The toolbar can be viewed as a double column or a single column. And note that the white triangle means that there's additional tools that are hidden. And if I just click and hold, I'll see those additional tools. Panels can be moved, repositioned, and you can always find other panels under the View menu. So you can open additional panels and let them float or dock them and then close them.